Hey, it's your fertility goddess, Wandi here again, here with another metaphysical tip and trick to help you improve your metaphysical life. So today we're going to talk about terminating soul contracts. So what exactly does that mean? Well, what that is, is if you're in a relationship with someone, and it doesn't necessarily have to be a love relationship. It could be a relationship with a parent, a sibling, a friend, but that relationship is filled with drama and chaos and all kinds of negativity. And it seems like no matter what you do, you just can't seem to get out of this relationship. Maybe you escape for a little while and then somehow you get roped back into it and you keep trying and trying, but all of your efforts just, it's just not working out. And so, typically, this sounds like it is a soul contract with someone that you agreed to come back here with to try to resolve issues from another lifetime, also known as the soulmate relationship. Well, if you have tried and tried and tried to make it work with this person or persons, and it just isn't working out and you're just more and more miserable, then you are under no obligation to stay in this contract. Go ahead and terminate that contract. So you might say to me, well, if I made a contract to resolve these issues and they're not resolved yet, then how can I terminate the contract? If anything, I would be in breach of it. Well, that's not true. Because if you have tried and tried and tried and have not managed to resolve anything, then your inability or the other person's inability to come to a resolution is a resolution in itself. And there comes a time when you have to stop, you know, banging your head against the wall and just go ahead and let it go so that you can be free to get on to other business and so can that person. So all you have to do is just sit quietly and say to yourself that I, with love, terminate the soul contract that I have with whoever it is and walk away wishing peace, love, joy, and light to both of us as we continue on our separate journeys. So it is. And then you can go ahead, put that relationship in the rearview mirror where it belongs, and get on with your own path, your own journey to love and happiness and success. So this has been your fertility goddess, Rondi here, here with another metaphysical tip and trick to help you improve your metaphysical life. Please share this with a friend. And please visit my website at www healinghannagoddess.com And as you know, I believe that we are all divine beings with the ability to not only bless ourselves, but each other. So I bless you with the divine confidence to go ahead and cancel the contract and walk towards a better future, a better journey, so that you can be happy and successful and fulfilled and I send that blessing also to the person to whom you are ending that soul contract with and I ask you to please pass this blessing on to someone else that you know needs it. Thank you again so much for watching. Please share this with a friend. Namaste.